this is the wooden water tank that I just showed you in the previous video that is the running water dropping there and this water comes from the brook through a pipe from the foot uh, from the uh, brook up in the hills and this is something I found it extremely interesting looks a lot like the big stone uh, where we make dosa with a, a huge mortar and pestle where we make the batter for dosa and even in Africa in Nigeria they pound uh, yam boiled yam and cassava in such kind of stones but here in Taming Long I was speaking to the elders and no this stone is not used for cassava or for yam pounding yam not for uh, urad dal or rice for dosa but this have a closer look there is water inside it's a huge if you can see my size 5 shoes now compare the size of this stone that's how big the stone is it's not a small stone and in between is this uh, uh, you know dent or hole where there is water now this stone is where um, the villages in olden times and even now they use a creeper from the forest and the stem part of the plant is crushed here it's first beaten on the sides of the aperture and then it is crushed in this part with water and then the mixture is used to wash your scalp in place of shampoo because in olden times there was no shampoo and it's supposed to be very good for hair cures dandruff and tomorrow I've made a plan with the community here to have an organic shampoo wash so please watch this space for organic shampoo wash tomorrow we are going to find those herbs we are going to crush them here and I'm going to shampoo and tell you how my hair feels like.